me fellow Sierra Leoneans them. Now good evening. Today, April 23rd, 2024. And it's past 10 o'clock na night. I mean, promise when I say today, I did do two video broadcasts tonight. One, na on the Trapartite Committee. The second one, na on the State of Emergency for Kush. This one, na the one on the Trapartite Committee. Some of you na tomorrow morning, on na go watch this. One thing I want to make very clear up front is that I address the nation. I know they talk to only APC. I they address the nation. And before I go further for address the nation, make a play the thing where they unify we all as Sierra Leoneans. The one thing where we all united in that thing day. We are the national anthem. And they can't play the national anthem. And they unify with all, whether you be green SIPP, red APC. The national anthem is our common factor. But before I go further, I want to show now this is not a CD plate where I don't get over 11 years now. I don't get this CD plate for over 11 years. This is a CD plate where me former boss, one of the first assignments where he may give me when I begin work in the state house as special executive <laughs> assistant. This CD plate is a video where they may give me assignment. Say, make a look into a complaint when me come up to the attention of my former boss, when I mean the then president of the Republic of Sierra Leone, Dr. Anes Michael Omar. So, give me the CD plate. If I look on the CD plate, you will see the right national anthem, Kenema Bio Kadisi Say, and right there. This was over 11 years ago, in 2013. An intelligence complaint may come up from Kenema to State House, and it's by Kuma in State House. That then they mean as special executive assistant to the president. And mean as somebody who I very much love the laws of Sierra Leone. I can read various laws of Sierra Leone. And my former boss may aware of that. So give me the CD plate and the confidential complaint. The complaint when me come, it was a confidential dispatch. We say Julius Madabio go address in people in Akenema alongside in then on the meet with them in just on defeat. I mean just all lost the 2012 elections. So for the very first time, then go to Kenema. And before Julius Madabio talk to the people in Kenema, he make them play for him the national anthem. So people then send a report to the then president of Sierra Leone, a confidential report, a complaint. They record the one whole program with Madabio talk, with Kadisi talk, the national anthem. 
So the then president called me, give me the assignment, give me the confidential dispatch, give me the CD plates. I get an TTD. So make a look and go through the laws of Sierra Leone. Then we don't advise and certain advice. Certain people, they don't give and certain advice. I don't call the name of the people them. I don't call the advice. So that even then, they are Now the same chair also has it on. Put on a DVD. I watch the video. Indeed. Julius mother be make them play the national anthem before he address the people of Kenema. But I don't see nothing wrong with that. I don't see no law we say that they wrong for make a defeated presidential candidate play the national anthem before he talk to him people then. So when I do my report for my former boss the next morning, I get for include inside they say we need for play the national anthem even more. There is a reason why we they play the national anthem. Even them picking in a school, then they play national anthem in the morning. Put them together before they go to the class them. So I see I don't see nothing wrong with waiting Julius Mother Bill do. I don't see nothing wrong with waiting Kadi C then do. And my former boss, he scrap all the other talk with them. He don't tell him about waiting for do, about this national anthem. But you see, this now when a president gets good people the way they around them, where they get good advice, where they make, you know, take decisions the way detrimental. If you want to take decision, you get to be a decision where really important for the state in well-being. Not to petty decisions for score one up manism on somebody when are you political opponent. So I start this broadcast today by playing the national anthem deliberately because not so only the president get the right to play national anthem before he begin talk. All citizens of Sierra Leone. Secondly, all citizens of Sierra Leone get the right to address the nation. Like how they address the nation so now. You within the nation we want to listen to me, you go listen to me. You within the nation where you no want to listen to me, you not go listen to me. It's not a big deal. So I don't forget and declare for some people then we get this believing say the presidency, the president so powerful that now no more for play the national anthem, now no more for address the nation. No. Dr. Sylvia Olenka Blyden can address the nation. Dr. Sylvia Olenka Blyden can play the national anthem. Like how I just don't play the national anthem. Now, as I said just now, when you get a president where he gets good people the way they near him, he good. But when you get a president where so so halaki motamande, where they incite them for they do bad. A president the in legacy is doomed. History could get a doomed recording. So it's up to you, based on your character, the type of person you be. If you now somebody who naturally you barbaric, naturally you evil, naturally you bad. If you ascend to the presidency, it is show. You know, they're able because now you become so powerful. And God forbid, you get people around you with then get agenda. And then no say you barbaric, you evil, you bad. Then we we'll push you for the waiting they want. And at the end of the day, now you own legacy, now they suffer. Today, I can't talk about the tripartite committee, but I begin how I begin deliberately. I want to set the stage for which they can talk. Me people them, I want to know something before we can talk about the tripartite committee. President Julius Madabio na in win the 2023 elections. President Julius Madabio na the duly re-elected president of Sierra Leone. 
I want you to sink that fact till it falls into our head. And they talk here with authority. And they talk here with no sentiments. The duly re-elected president of Sierra Leone, both under the laws of Sierra Leone and the numbers of voters we cast them vote for her at Julius Madabio. They, we get questions around the parliamentary results. We get questions around the local council results, especially in the north and the western axis of Sierra Leone. But when it comes to the presidency, there's no question. Julius Malabiona, the duly re-elected president of Sierra Leone, and then conduct the elections between Julius Madabio and Dr. Samura Matthews in Kamara 100 times. Julius Madabio will beat Dr. Samura Matthews in Kamara 100 times under the circumstances where they all took contest last year, 2023. If not the same circumstances then they, Julius Madabio will beat Samura Kamara 100 times, elect and conduct the election 100 times. This is a fact. I don't be a political observer for over 30 years. I am an expert in Sierra Leone politics. And it was clear that those results that were coming out were going to be a clean victory for Julius Madabio. Now, then they give now this talk, see, because they're not inaugurated. In that grand inauguration, we don't invite people there, make them big. That means to say, because there's no special inauguration, then you know, the sign that he's not elected, he's not duly re-elected. Well, I want to take on a way not politically inclined back to the year 2002, May 2002 to June, July, 2002. That is 22 years ago. When we get the president, then they call him Dr. Ahmad Tijan Kaba. Ahmad Tijan Kaba win the 2002 elections by a landslide. That 10 day, and we don't take sabbatical from the APC because my party, they get beaucoup, beaucoup, beaucoup fet, fet amongst themselves that 10 day. And the young people that are Sierra Leone, they don't identify me. They say this woman is a leader. So they form a party, they call a Young People's Party. And me, I'm mean, the national leader. We get the Young People's Party for be registered. So now we contest against Amati Jankaba in 2002, the SIPP, the Young People's Party, and all the other political parties. We are the opposition. We contest against the SLPP. Ahmad Tijan Kaba win those elections by a landslide. Beat all side, western area, south, east. I did not come on some side that they were not win, but he had a landslide victory. This was in May 2002. But Ahmad Tijan Kaba not get no special inauguration where he do for in the election. So anybody where they tell you now say, because Mother Bio, they not re, they not do inauguration for a, for a re-election, that means to say, in to president, the person the full owner. What did Amati Jankaba do in July 2002? When then they open parliament, he make, they make an inauguration at the parliament, then swear at the parliament, then they swear in all the members of parliament. So they don't make any special inauguration for himself. Of course, Julius Mada Biosef may get the option for do the same thing last year, but I not feel say he get advisors them who mean smart, like how Tijan Kabayo advisors them in smart. So anybody where they tell him and say because there is no inauguration of Julius Mada Bio, that means to say he's not the president, that person is a clown, that person is a fool, that person is a type of misleading. President Julius Madabio is the duly re-elected president of Sierra Leone. 
under the laws of Sierra Leone and under any logical analysis where you can think about, nobody knows the pull and they it don't intend you. Keep that in mind. Now, this may be the first time where I really, apart from that time for that coup, where I come out for expose Anes by Koma and Julius Mother Bio, because they all two are exposed that time. They courageously, at the America, I courageously expose the two of them that now then they create problems in this country. Because they get deals, then when they do behind them back, then they also not believe themselves. So this they undermine this, this they undermine this, and this they say, well, I will sponsor cool because you know what for do what you things say you for do. So I had to come out courageously and say them things then they for people them. But other than that, where I break my silence because of the cool. When I remember, say I not talk nothing about politics, not pull audios or much about politics per se for over one year now. When the elections done, I mean tell people them say, no matter be in the elections, I make it clear. That I'm in the London. I remember I'm go for medical, I'm in the London. I make it clear from London, say no matter be win the elections. And I talk again this night. Now, Mother Bio win the 2023 elections. But why I mean keep silent all this time? Why not me they talk? Well, I mean, hint on I'm recent in our program, but I will talk and back again now today. Me, I don't depend on politics for long, over 30 years. Furthermore, I born inside political family. And I mean, lucky. Forget a grandpa when I'm a powerful politician. Where he teach me politics. He show me pocketing them about Sierra Leone politics. And then me self back I learn politics. And I know say one thing upon this two in politics. When the crowd of the grassroots, the people they win and then get the votes, if they don't put their mind one way fixed you come for try for explain to them waiting at the truth you they waste your time then it don't happen especially with my party the all people's congress the apc i find out say because of the trust with the apc grassroots they mean get per anes by Kuma, Samura Kamara and the leadership of the APC. No matter what I mean, they talk. That trust where them people then they mean get. When me mean consider for be a misplaced trust. That trust they, then not they listen to me. Me not say what me mean they talk. Now the honest truth. Me not say all what I mean they tell APC me party. I mean the honest truth. Everything I mean they advise them. I mean the honest truth. But me party because of the love and the trust and the confidence where they mean get. Pa Anes by Koma, Samura Kamara, Sheri Koko, and the other leaders. We mean they misdirect the party, misdirect the grassroots. Because of that trust. Whatever Sylvia Olanka blind them in the talk that day, they're not me they pay attention. I mean a smart politician. When you people they're not they pay attention, you stay cool, you take a back seat, you're not a good player, you know whoever get for fat for vest. I drop that hint they want it. Say good player, not go ever fat for vest. You're a very good player, so I decide for take a back seat. And allow the show for go on. Because I mean, no waiting at the outcome of the show where they go on. And even now, because I know waiting at the outcome of waiting there for can happen, I make her they can't talk to her this night about the tripartite committee. When I realize, say, the deal, the backdoor deals, where they between Julius Madabio and Esbai Koma and the other APC I like by them. The deal so powerful that no way not there on earth 
we are going to convince people then because for convince people then one you need your own integrity and your own name we don't make for yourself but two you need money politics needs money I mean, I'm get money for challenge. Imagine for challenge and his by coma money one and mother be money other and that kind of money they wouldn't all to get for challenge. I'm not get that kind of money day. So I had to take a back seat and allow the show for go on. When we people them just for the same reason we make, I mean, come out for talk where they could be when I can expose so many things them will happen. I expose about the Qatar, the King of Qatar deal. I expose about UBA Bank. I expose about so many money laundering. I expose things then because it was necessary for Sierra Leoneans then for know the danger where they happen behind closed doors. Tonight, I they come back again for expose things then. The tripartite committee. Because I'm tired for me, them full now. So I can't tell Una today the real truth. Una we want for believe me, well and good. Una we still want for continue for believe. Then want them. We don't lie pa on a lie pa on a lie pa on a lie pa on a tell. Look inside the APC party day right now. Look inside our country in democracy day right now. Now na business. But what they can do so tonight? That for posterity. And they can't talk tonight for posterity. And for those of Una, we still get Una aid then correct. They're not brainwash Una completely too much. And they also talk to Una tonight. You see, what we get right now on social media are a bunch of loud people there. But I know it's 50. Then they talk, 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 talk. Then they noise. But they know it's 50. And me, I get the confidence say, all that noise when they make, a lot of owner will not they make noise. When then they refer to them as the silent majority. When I able to think beyond that noise, when then less than 50, so-called commentators then they make pauna that noise then they make pauna tonight i come for tell and say when i left for pay attention then i dotted and they dotted the water this blogger this blogger apc this apc that media this media that they're all agents if you don't catch up yet stay now today when i can when i can learn when I call on a company, them, make them log on, make them can learn today. And I focus them on the tripartite committee. First of all, what are them people are loud? The loudest people there. I tell them that today, say, the loudest people there, where they tell them about this tripartite, tripartite, tripartite committee, tripartite, tripartite, action, tripartite. Now they want them where they go to Mother Bio Nanet. And you remember, not to me talk how Mother Bio Nanet don't tell me. So then can go to the Nanet secretly. Then they go beg them. And what they go beg them for are because they get corruption case, money laundering case. Most of them get different, different case them where they didn't Mother Bio in table for them. So they want in there now they're loud, they're really, really loud about this trapatite. Oh, this trapatite, oh, Mother Bill, the elections is not yet over until it is over. The elections is not over until it is over. The people in a game, yeah? A game. I got my big brother. In your corruption matter, we get big, big corruption matter, huge corruption matter. Get land with him and his bike home. They don't make corruption deal in a hill station. You get also a bill where you know you account for so I pull the money from. He say now in daughter, he named them at the house. But under the laws of Sierra Leone, unexplained wealth, 
you get for explain so I pull that money there. You know, I will explain. And you get so many other corruption issues there within a mother being table. But that mortal man then I loud pass all for big fool people then on social media about trapatite, trapatite, trapatite committee, trapatite committee. So why this man they mislead people then so? This man is not a fool. Me, I don't sit on a cabinet. In fact, now I'm in the right next to me in a cabinet. When me sit on so, in the sit on so, logo score mind at the other hand. A very, very smart politician. Very smart and intelligent person. But today, when I go see the kind of social media, he talk like a big fool. He talk like a clown. He they talk like a, like a idiot. But this trapatite, trapatite, trapatite. So why this man they turn himself to clown? Why this very intelligent big brother of mine? They misbehave so they mislead with people them about trapatite committee. See, they get forget they run. The elections are not over until they are over. The elections are not over until they are over. Why, why, why they do this? Why they misbehave so? Why they behave like a clown? Well, before I go into that clownish behavior, let me go into the post-election period, immediately after the election done. I want to have a member say, now four elections that will conduct, not of presidential elections no more. Four elections were conducted in this country, four. And then for elections they day, according to the laws of Sierra Leone, each of them then get the procedure by which you they challenge the election here. If the election not go according to how it will go, and most importantly, you get evidence for show sure say the election not go how the election supposed for go. So the first election are the presidential elections. For Eon, the law say. Within seven days, where the national returning officer, the chief electoral commissioner, announced the results and the name of the winner of the elections for the presidential elections, within seven days, if you no say, then don't rogue you. You for immediately file a petition na the Supreme Court of Sierra Leone for sure say, then don't rogue you. That na for the presidential elections. But we conduct three other elections again. We conduct the parliamentary elections. We conduct local council elections. And then we conduct the head of local councils elections, when are the mayors and district chairman elections. And for them, three elections then they, each of them, the law, and I will quote the section of the Public Elections Act of 2022. Section 145 of that act, they say, you get 21 days, 21 days for challenge any rubbish yuki yuki where they do pan the elections. You get 21 days from the day where they publish the results, not the gazette. Listen at the talker again, may people them. The law say you get 21 days for the presidency, na seven days. For all the other elections, parliament, local council, mayors and district chairman, you get 21 days. Now, after that 21 days pass, it's over. You can't challenge the results anymore. You don't do. No grounds, no day under the law by which you can challenge the elections. For them, three elections, then they. For the presidency, you get seven days. We see that seven days they done. No grounds, no day under the law by which you can change the elections, by which you can get a rerun of the elections. There can be no rerun of any elections. Finally, still on this post-elections and election business, 
then talk, they don't talk a lot about the role of Mohamed Kinewe Kone, the chief electoral commissioner. But nobody not honest up to this point for Abu Toxi, what the law say for that mandate is simple. He said the only work where that mandate gets when it comes on presidential and other elections, it work where it gets for do. Now for collect the results within the DM from the regions. Take calculator, Adam, the results within Giam, he Adam, then he announced them. That man, they, the law not there, no owners from polling station level, district level, tallying level, in other hands, they, other than the administrative head of the electoral commission. When he can't announce in the results, now waiting the regional officer Giam, now he for announce. So if the regional officer again Botobata, a Botobata I go announce. That's what the law say. And it's unfortunate that that's what the law say. So now one of the things then where the law need for change, so that the chief electoral commissioner not restricted for only announce waiting then Giam, but if I able to get the powers for go beyond the regional results within Giam to the district, to the presiding, to the polling station levels, it will take a longer time. But it will eliminate a lot of them doubtful problems there. Me people them, when I go recall, say 2018, I mean, go to the Supreme Court for challenge the elections of President Julius Mada Bill. And one of the things then we I mean point out that the Supreme Court is that we get too many holes in the laws of the land where it comes by elections. So this trapartite committee, the good thing about them. Is that if they handle and well, all their holes then they where me mean see we make them go Supreme Court. And all their holes then where they make people and they always get doubt about elections from 1996, where Dr. John Karifa Smart get doubts about elections, Dr. Abbas Bundu himself may get doubts about elections in 1996, 2002, there was some initial doubts, but the kind where we Tijan Kaba beats. 2002, the kind of landslide. <laughs> Pass you are arguing about, but he, he really may win the elections day without much doubt. But he may still get people the way he concerns. So, what is the trapartite committee? The outcome of them, my people, them, and then I listen carefully. The only outcome from the trapartite committee are one how we will fix the laws, them, so that them problem they are, then doubts they are, not going to reoccur in future elections. But if anybody tell Una say there is going to be a rerun of elections or the elections are not over until they are over, and whatever, you know that my brother we can just come on social media, I can just pull all the audio talk. But I will come back again to Ranjistan. All they talk and everything they tell Una but trapartite committee, that rubbish. A trapartite committee not there for give no such recommendation for rerun elections. And in fact, Chef, as I tell Una, Mother Bill, I win the elections here. Yeah. I don't observe elections for the longest possible times. All the indices, they point to that. The side we get question, that with the parliamentary results, the local council ele elections, the mayor's election, but the presidential elections, Mother Bill win the elections clean. There's no doubt there. But apart from the fact that <laughs> The chief electoral commissioner, in order no blame for this whole thing where they happen. Because the law say, waiting the regional office again, in fact, the language where the law says, if for tally and compute and announce. Now listen, tally, compute, announce. So when the regional office again results, elect na buto bata results, now they tally, now they compute, now they announce. This is a fact. That's what the law say as of now. But me people them we get a problem now, Sierra Leone. And we all recognize that there's a problem. That problem within the Sierra Leone I make we they get blackout. 
Ta problem we dans Sierra Leone. Na e make today I do a very sorrowful piece with one medical doctor, Dr. Jerry Dean George. Very sad piece. The woman they write to say what are the say what are the pull up in the eye. Me they read them what are the pull up in the eye. You know why made that need to happen? Because we have a problem in this country. You know why make could they get blacked out? We have a problem in this country. We suppose for the run a democratic state. And the beauty about democracy is accountability, transparency. But that's not the calm by magic. It's not, it not just the calm, it happened by magic, transparency and accountability. It's not the happen by magic. Because human beings, human beings by nature, they don't want to be accountable. They want the law of the jungle, the strongest, whatever he able to do, he do them. That's the natural, that's the natural human being. That civilization they make, the human being become accountable, become transparent. But the instinctive, primitive human being, he no want to be transparent, he no want to be accountable. So if you not get measures in place, checks and balances in the democracy, where they hold a government accountable, that government they instinctively as human beings they are selfish and if nobody not they hold them accountable they will behave selfishly and that selfishness then and they lead to waiting they happen in our hospitals waiting they happen in our electricity the energy sector waiting they happen in our schools waiting they happen with the roads waiting they happen with the kind of dirty or the sina street what will happen with just the gross malfunctioning of the society there's no checks. There's no balance. There's no accountability. There's no oversight. Why does it happen? It happens because for a democracy, a democratic state for really function, the president and the governing party, then for no say if they not do their work fine, the opposition they they as the government in waiting. If they not do their work fine, the opposition did it for pounds on them, for tell the public, say, look, they not do their work fine, no. They need to do their work fine, no. The opposition did for expose them, for they systematically they expose them, all what they do were not correct. The president know that, the government know that, in a functioning democracy. But we can expect sometimes for make the opposition turn a blind eye, one one them to certain things them. But not to all the time, to the extent we speaking at the dying hospital, to the extent we not get light, to the extent we they suffer, the roads are not good, so many problems because the opposition not the function. So the question where you ask yourself is. All these things, the way they happen because the opposition had the function. How come? Well, in the care, we go back to the same tripartite committee and all this noise within the social media about the tripartite committee. You see, me people, them, what do we get right now? Now, the opposition sector, now waiting the white man and call charlatan. Charlatan. C-H-A-R-L-A-T-A-N, a charlatan. A charlatan is a fake. A charlatan, they pretend for be what it is not. A charlatan, nine Sierra Leone, they under as opposition right now. We get charlatans pretending to be opposition. Charlatans going to Mother Biona in Osnanet. Charlatans go for go cut deal behind closed doors. Charlatans. Come now na parliament, come now na the offices, na, na the uh, uh, opposition party offices, and pretend like for certain they are opposition. They are not opposition, they are charlatans. Then they wear bright red clothes, team up na parliament, they holler, they talk. Perfect charlatans. 
And this charlatanry, now they don't care go now to the next level where they call tripartite committee. That tripartite committee day, where they where they, then charlatans here yeah, they come forward and tell them so much hopes. Then you go now so much hopes. One, one second, I drink some water. Then they go now so much hopes. When I went at the opposition grassroots, light power now they go now so much, uh, um, uh, um, uh, you know, anxiousness. Like something good is gonna happen out of this. Then, uh, then people are uh, the same people who uh, say mother be me don't tell we. See, then they go to an aneto. They not change it too. Then still they go to an aneto. Now the same people they are. And then they can't tell when I say, Trapatite Committee, better get for come inside day. They want to not believe. That's charlatans. That's fakes. But when I mark my words, these charlatans, the ending, they get for be very ugly. Because God not asleep. God, they always expose them in the end. For now, then believe say, then deal the way in the court. They come for mislead the grassroots, tell them about trapatite committee, how mad be not win elections, how mad be not win elections, order with man and go make sure say mad be not win elections, and go call for the run of elections. Charlatans. Fakes. Maybe for them. Then people yeah, they all get corruption case within a matter behind the table. Then corruption case not lost yet, it not disappear. Where's I go? It not going away. They still get corruption case. They all they still get corruption case. Then they don't matter behind control because then files they look at like it not matter behind the table. They all are the challenging this night. Anyway, we no say in in corruption case within a commission of inquiry. It not matter behind the table. Can't answer me. Say yes, that me corruption case. Not to better corruption case, mother be not get control over me. So what are the try for saying uh, is very, very clear. Nobody not let out the country day. And we all want to get a function in democracy. The basics, the basics, basics. Let we hospital the work. Let we let forget blackout. Let we schools them basics, just just the basics, not anything extraordinary. We just want the basics. Rather than the opposition, they work for make sure they so will get the basics. The opposition they spend all their time now. They mislead people them about tripartite committee. Tripartite committee, we go forget the run of elections. Tripartite committee, tripartite committee, we run of elections. So they waste all their time, all their energy. They talk about a trapatite committee. We're not going to produce nothing like a rerun elections. Rather than, then they spend their time for do checks and balances of this government in excesses. So instead of, then they do checks and balances for us, President Mada BOC, this car power ship, this electricity, for this car power ship, we need you for come and explain to we better than they do am. All waiting, they can't tell now. Trapatite committee. In fact, they said tomorrow, one political party saying get press conference on Trapatite committee. What a joke. We forget press conference about very seriously what they happen at the country. Now, Trapatite committee, now they go get press conference on. But elections, we are very well know, say, mother be a winner. We are not say they're not going to forget the run. So, you are wasting our people's time. You are not acting as the democratic opposition. Spending all your time talking about trapartite committee. Because when they take with people them as fools, the people then trust to the people then believe in them. So when they use, abuse that trust, that love, that belief where the people then get power now. When they abuse them for una young good. So instead of una focus on attention on criticizing President Madabio on the key issues like the hospitals. On the key issues like the blackout, on they spend all on a time, the full people them say when I talk about tripartite committee. Tripartite committee will not going to produce nothing like I wait to they talk about. I don't very well know that. 
But because when I get corruption case them, na mother bill in desk, and when I afraid mother bill, so on a agenda, simple. Take the dialogue away from the key issues and we focus them on non-existent issues. And what are the non-existent issues there? The new one, they say ICC, International Criminal Court. My brother and my sister, they joke around you. No such thing as International Criminal Court no day for Mother Bill. All of this na diversion. Trapartite committee na diversion. ICC talk na diversion. What you for the talk about now as opposition is how to keep Mother Bio on his democratic toes. How for oppose them? How for make sure say we they criticize them? This blackout. How for make sure say we they criticize them? The way people then they die in a hospital. The way the roads then dirty. How for make sure say we criticize the real issues? Then they spend time on that. They spend all that time like charlatans. Diverting attention away from the real issues to non-issues of tripartite committee. Now misleading, misleading. Now. Me people are the challenge now today, and I want for now name Honorable Alaji Kemosi. Honorable Alaji Kemosi is a powerful politician, but today I want challenge on this net. I want challenge him. And I want to challenge them all where they say there is going to be a rerun of elections. I want to challenge them all where they say President Mada Bio not win these elections. And how I want to challenge them? It's simple. The RRF forms. Honorable Alaji Kemosi say, if you not say as you tell within this year, now you may be in charge of Potloko, Kareni, and Cambia district. Produce the RRF forms them where they show say mother be you lost the elections. And I challenge you if you get them, produce them. Me people are telling us something. Let we take free town, just free town. We don't need for go put local, we don't need for go Cambia, we don't need for go Falaba or, or Tongolili or Kailao, or, we don't need for go far. Let's take free town. Freetown get less than 2,000 polling stations. Less than 2,000 polling stations. Which means the APC supposed to forget less than 2,000 RRF forms for the presidential elections. Less than 2,000 RRF forms for the mayor elections. Less than 2,000 RRF forms for the parliamentary elections. Less than 2,000 RRF forms for the local councillors' elections. Me people them, 10 months, 10 months after those elections, the APC cannot produce the RRF forms for even Freetown. Even Freetown. Are they challenging this night and are they tell them, say, then take the RRF forms, then they. Then go sell them, then go negotiate with them, then go auction, then go mortgage those RRF forms in strategic places in Sierra Leone, including at Hill Station. Are they challenging today? If not lie, they lie, we not produce the RRF forms for Freetown, just Freetown. We don't need for the whole country. Produce the RRF forms for Western area, Freetown. You go hear then, oh, we have produced 60%, we have produced 80%. What is so difficult for produce 100% of the IRA reforms for free time? Because I don't go auction them, when I don't go negotiate with them, so you don't have them. And we find ourselves now in this situation where 10 months after the elections, the APC does not have the IRA reforms, but they keep on misleading our people that. There's going to be a trapartite calling for a rerun. How they go call for rerun with RRF reform self on a nugget? Kemosi say with the RRF reform support local. Pull up. Kemosi say, pull the RRF reforms for put local. Please. Because I collect all. If you know so I don't negotiate with them. Pull up. Pull the RRF reforms for Kareni. 
Pour les ARA réformes sont cambia. Mais pour on a on a dit la ARA réformes. This are the form way every political party where they conduct contest elections. You polling agent in the present way they count. They in the sign the electoral commission the sign the observer they sign the other political party they all sign all man get one one copy then go with another party office. So if Kemo is saying you may be in charge for then three districts and they where the ARA reforms for then three districts then they for the presidential elections pull up Freetown Mayor of Freetown where you ARA reforms them pull up Freetown because Freetown that small enclosed area not so art place not to so the side where you go say oh this na bien chonko lili where they may come with the ARA reforms now the motorbike get accident. Now the ARA reforms all scatter. Or you go say, oh, na bien falaba. Then me the car with the ARA reforms by boat. Now in the boat capside the water. ARA reforms all go na the water. Freetown. When I never produce the ARA reforms for Freetown, now they can't talk about tripartite committee. When I left for fool with people them. Let us focus with attention on what is a democratic opposition. Call the government to order. This ship where they make now will get blackout. This situation will begin and they die in the hospitals. The democratic opposition, because it's a charlatan, nine day day, so we're not able to oppose. You can see Mortar Man. Well, red, red, like a today. I see one. <laughs> Member of Parliament. <laughs> you come on, Cambia. Cambia, member of Parliament. Well, red, red, is in a Parliament. I speaking on behalf of the APC with my red, red. I look the joker. I say, how long they were facing them with the fool people there? Say, so then they talk on behalf of APC. If you talk on behalf of APC, you'll be talking for make sure say, things are working in the government. You'll be opposing the government on critical issues. You're not going to waste time. They talk about trapatite committee, trapatite committee, trapatite committee. When issues then they're on the ground, when are real issues? Those are you tribalism issues of bringing, oh, in the southeast, schools are not going to this. In the northwest, schools are. These are all tribal, regional nonsense. These are not opposition positions. Opposition positions are constructive positions. We need forget read of this whole discussion on trapatite where they divert with attention we need forget discussions on real issues them summon the government and ask them what in the being so so and so and so so and so not the function how can begin they can't tell me about trapatite committee spending all the time for trapatite committee and they tell me people them na deal then they do this because they get corruption cases 30 day. They get criminal cases 30 day. The mayor of Freetown is still get criminal case in a court 30 day. Dr. Samura Kamara is still get corruption case in a court 30 day. Kemosi says still get corruption issues 30 day. So before they spend time, they do what they for do for keep the democracy functional. Then busy they tell you now. Trapatite committee, trapatite committee, trapatite committee. My people, enough is enough. Let them left for full now, but trapatite committee. What do we want now? Na proper democratic opposition. We tire for Yeri, but trapatite committee. We not get for talk. Nothing but rerun. If we not believe in ourselves, we not pull the RRF reforms them. If we're not get our reforms, forgive me, for God's sake, please shut up on Trapatite Committee. Enough is enough. When I don't spend so much time, they fool with people. Them, I keep quiet because I know say the way when I people, the people them, they don't get euphoria. The way the people them entrust and believe una from the Anesbai Koma to the Samura Kamara to the Mayor of Freetown to Kemosi say to all of you. The people them don't so believe una, that electricity if you're blind and they talk, they don't get for listening. So I back out and allow the show for God. But now we don't reach a level when I land in the next 
broadcast there for beef. We the one for take this country and put them under a state of emergency. The wicked mother man there. They want for give we 12 months of a state of emergency. God. It's not enough that they on the one year, almost one year, not the workers' opposition. Just they talk about trapatite committee, trapatite committee, trapatite committee. When a nonsense, then the alleged Sega for come out of that trapatite committee. Anybody tell Una, say the trapatite committee, therefore produce a rerun. As can say, produce the ARA reforms. If Kemo si say, say, then go for get run. Say produce the ARA reforms, Kemo, for put local one time. Produce the ARA reforms. Anybody tell Una, say, then go for get rerun. Say, well, free tongue ARA reforms. Because free tongue, free tongue, excuse not day. You're not going to say that the boat capsize. You're not going to say that the Okada for them. Free tongue, na small area. Produce the ARA reforms for free time and shut up about Trapatite Committee calling a rerun. There's not going to be any rerun. The time for rerun don't pass. 21 days after they announced the results for Parliament, local council, and seven days after they announced the results for the presidency. Anybody tell them say there's going to be a rerun? Na lie, they lie. Anybody with fashion for the tell on a trapatite, trapatite, trapatite committee, tell and say where the RRA forms. Dr. Richard Conte, where the RRA forms. Dr. Kaifala Mara, where the RRA forms. These are the questions we should be asking them. Let them let for tell about trapatite committee. And let them start for allow we were not afraid for be the democratic opposition of this country. And before I end, I want to give a message to the SLPP. When I know they realize that now, because when they enjoy, but when I mark what I tell them this night, now the last message that they close this broadcast with, what do they do to our party? When they damage and destroy our party. The late former president of blessed memory, his Excellency, Alaji Dr. Amati Jankaba. On the day we win elections in May 2002, he make a statement. He said, he wants for make sure, say, he get a very strong opposition because a democracy needs a strong opposition. On a day the SIPP, on a day watch, on a president, he not get no opposition with Soba. When are they glad? When are they say Tijanka about me stupid? When he ask for make sure say we get a strong opposition? He not stupid. He no say for and for function, he need for be put on in tools. When are they allow a leader for they continue for cut deals? Anything I mean tell we, I tell we all saying they cut deal, they can go to her and get deal, they can not solve it for them. Say, okay, wait on a thief. When I go with Twitter, when I mean don't thief. When I go with Twitter, when I mean don't thief. Now I tell we all. So President Mandela, when they allow him for cut them deal there with them people, yeah, he fine. For now, but in the long run, when they destroy our party image, trust me. No government, not for day, in other strong opposition, and then charlatan the way. President Mada be of in the deal with these charlatans. Where if he say they making life easy for him. Mark my words, Your Excellency. Those are not oppositions. If they were oppositions, you're not going to get all this problem where they continue for they get over and over and over. With instability, coup, military, planning this, planning that, planning this, planning that. It's because there is no proper functioning democratic opposition in place. So SIPP. Something that they enjoy now. Where the APC, they make a mess of themselves with trapatite, 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 trapatite. Instead of them, they oppose them. Instead of them, they put them on their toes. And make sure, say, the electricity sector is working. Make sure, say, the hospitals are working. Make sure the roads, make sure the schools, make sure everything is functional. Putting you on your toes so that you can deliver. Instead of when they realize now, say, you cannot deliver without strong opposition. On a sudden, they enjoy where the APC they make a mockery 
about trapatite, trapatite, trapatite. But mark my words, you go tell me one day, President Julius Malabio's failure, if it happens, is because you in the SLPP, you allowed him to fail by destroying what should have been a functional, democratic opposition party. Let God bless we all. And before I end the broadcast, like how I start the broadcast, I go once again play the national anthem. We now we national anthem. We we all get as a unifying factor. And they unify we. Not to the president one game for listening national anthem. So before I end, I will play the national anthem. They play and back.